Hey, this is Elijah with the Oxygen team, and in today's video, I'm excited to show you what's new in Oxygen 4.7. This release is based almost entirely around improving the code authoring experience in Oxygen. We updated Code Mirror, which is the code editor that's used in the builder, which gave us access to some new features. So let's take a look in our style sheet here. First, you can see we have a few different themes available. By default, you're gonna be on Material Dark, but once you change that, it's saved globally and will be used across all code editors in Oxygen and the Style Sheets editor in the WordPress admin panel. For CSS, we do have some autocomplete, so if I start typing a property here, we're gonna get some suggestions, which can be super handy if you're not sure exactly what you're looking for. And if we jump over to a code block here, you'll see that we also have some autocomplete for HTML. So let's add a section and you can see it closes that tag for me automatically, which is handy. But then within the section, once it knows we're writing HTML, it's going to give us suggestions for tags to use as well. We also enabled code folding. So let's say there was a bunch of content in here and we wanted to look at our code without having to scroll up and down a bunch. There's a little arrow here on the left-hand side in the gutter that you can use to fold this whole section down, and that's gonna be available in all the code editors as well. Now, one thing I'm particularly excited about is the mixed view that we've added. So if you've ever used CodePen, this should look pretty familiar. If you click mixed view from any of the individual editors, you'll be able to edit all the types of code in a code block from one view. So I could add some CSS, and then I could go down here and add some JavaScript. When you're writing more complex custom components using PHP, HTML, CSS, and JavaScript, this is really gonna speed things up. Now from this view, we can click expand on any of the individual code editors to go into that code editor. We also added full search and replace. So if we hit command or control F while the code editor is focused, we're gonna get this new dialog. Note that this searches the entirety of the code, not just what you can see. So even if you had a bunch of code down here below the fold where you'd have to scroll to see it, it would be included in the search result. Let's search for echo and you can see it's gonna highlight that. Now let's search for A and it's showing us all the results and we can go ahead and go forward and backward through those results. We can also replace them with something and do a replace all. Let's put those back to the proper tag and let's replace all again. We also have the option to match case, use regex or search by word. So this powerful search is going to be very helpful when you're writing more complex code in Oxygen and need to find or replace something in that code. Overall, the code writing experience in Oxygen has improved a bunch with this release. And if you combine this with the fact that you can unwrap code blocks, you're now ready to write completely custom components and layouts using pure code in Oxygen without the limitations of our old code editor getting in the way. Now, in addition to these improvements to the code authoring experience, we also made a few tweaks. We updated the default YouTube video because the old one we used was no longer available. So if you add a video element, you're gonna see an oxygen video from our channel. We also fixed an issue with Easy Posts presets. So let's drop in an Easy Posts here. Now the issue was that a lot of our new presets had a query set to something other than default, which means if you use this on an archive, you wouldn't see the posts you would expect. Well, now they all start at the default query, which is more optimal. This means they're gonna pull the query from whatever you're viewing instead of overriding it by default. And one quick fix we made was the site navigation was failing to pull in the target attribute as designated in the WordPress menu settings. That has been corrected, so now you can set those links to open in a new tab if you want. So again, my name's Elijah with the Oxygen team, and that's what's new in Oxygen 4.7. Thanks for watching.